Hello and welcome to my new video which I am filming with my new camera and this video is all about the pre pair tag from Frida, some of you will know her. It's 20 questions which I will try to answer so let's stay if you're interested. Question number one. Why have you decided to be an au pair? Well, I wanted to do something different after school. I want to see the world, I want to travel, I want to improve my English skills and therefore it was either work or travel or au pair. And since I'm interested in playing and learning and laughing with children, I chose au pair. Second question, why in America? America is such a big country and has to offer so many different lifestyles and lives to explore. And I wanted to know what it means to live the American dream. Hopefully it won't be a nightmare. Third question, which agency did you choose and why? I chose cultural care as I explained in the first video because they seemed so friendly, so highly professional and also now I can come with every silly question, no matter what they will answer. Fourth question, when did you apply? I applied in January 2015 and the application process lasted two weeks, two or three weeks, two or three weeks. Question number five. How did you gain experience with working with children? I was a babysitter a few times, I looked after the children of the neighbors. Most of the hours of my experience I had in a kindergarten or daycare center because I went to a barkeep and we had to look after up to 25 children of the age of 0 to 6 years. Question number 6. How long did it take till you had your final family? It lasted 3 weeks. I had three different matches but the first two families didn't really seem nice and the third family was perfect for me and I matched with them in the end of February. Question number seven. What was your first expression of the family? They seemed really nice. It was love at first sight. In their application they presented their house as moderately neat which is really what I love because I like households clean but I don't want to clean the whole time. Also the host mom presented the family as a team and I really liked that idea. Question number eight. How many kids will you be taking care of? I will take care of two children. The younger one is a girl at the age of six and the older one is a boy at the age of ten. Question number nine. Where are you going to live? I will live in Maplewood, New Jersey, which is a suburban area of New York City. Question number ten. How are you going to live? I will have my own room and bathroom in the third floor of the house and there is only a guest room in this floor, so I will have the floor all by myself. Question number 11. Which are your three deepest fears? Number one, flight is cancelled. I am so excited that I will depart next week that I dream about my luggage being lost. I am also nervous about the family because, well, we Skyped a lot. I know the family, I know the parents, I know the kids. I love them, they love me. But who knows, my biggest fear is that I will go to rematch. Question number 12. What are your expectations? My expectations are that I have a good bond to the children, to the parents, that we have fun, that we can do everything we like together and also that um, I have a good bond to the au pairs in my area, though there are 50 au pairs in my area. Also I expect to travel a lot because New York City is very close and Philadelphia is two hours with the bus. Also have a lot of time so I expect to do a lot of blogging and vlogging. Question number 30. What will you miss most? Austrian food, my friends, my family, my pets. But I don't think there is a number one in this list. Also I heard bread is really terrible in the US so I'm gonna miss bread. And chocolate. Austrian chocolate. I will miss Austrian chocolate. Because when you're used to the good taste of Austrian or Swiss chocolate, then I think American chocolate won't be delicious. Question number 14. Is there something you won't miss? In Austria, shops close on Saturday afternoon and next open on Monday morning. So if you want to buy something on Sunday, you have no chance. Question number 15. What are you gonna do afterwards? I want to work for the Red Cross and I want to study midwife. Question number 16. What do you want to see in America? Well, there are a lot of things. I want to see the Grand Canyon, I want to see New York City, DC, Seattle, Albuquerque, Miami, there are so many things. Oh, and also the Niagara Falls and Key West. Question number 17. What are your goals? 
to become more responsible, to have a good relationship to my family, to my host kids, to return to Austria as a happy person. Question number 18. Do you feel culture shock? Well, a bit. There will be differences between American and Austrian uh, culture, but I think those differences are not that big. I am told Americans are more busy and eating habits are different, but we are not talking about some African state where people have to go a mile for a glass of water. So yes, there will be culture shock, but I'm not afraid of it. Question number 19. What does your family say? Well, they support my decisions, but as time passes by, we all are a bit sad that we don't have so much time together here. The last question, question number 20. What are you most excited about? I'm most excited about departuring because I'm going to a whole new world basically on my own and this will be really exciting. So that was the pre au pair tag by Freda. I will link her in the info box down below. And the next video will possibly be about packing, about packing my whole life into one suitcase. That will be impossible. But I will try to take the camera with me. So see you next time.